All right, and we are back. Just gonna do this. There we go. Ah. Hot Rod's gonna watch this all night. Fantastic. Uh, if everybody's ready to go. Oh, Hot Rod, thank you very much for the follow, by the way. I have made myself a delicious cocktail. It's mostly vodka. Um, <laughs> I'll check the volume levels real quick, actually. I'm always paranoid that I forgot to turn the mic back on. Okay, we're fine. Good, good, good. Uh, minimize you. There we go. What did I make? Uh, I made a spiced apple cider with uh, vodka, sour apple pucker, and a little bit of Midori. Um, it's it's quite tasty. It tastes like a sour apple sucker. You know those caramel apple suckers that you used to get back in the day. Uh. Hello? Who is that? Park? No, we haven't met before. Is this Park? I think we're safe. Oh, I was so worried something had gone wrong. What's your name? Robin Bass, Theta Field Service Technician. Nice to meet you, Robin. How did you get here? I got scanned, like the others. And then I killed myself. Oh. At least I think so. I can't remember that part. How does that work? Did Donnie you wondering what to the Ark? Wow, you're definitely not from Theta. Let me guess, Omicron? Hmm. Wasn't sure Catherine would be able to scan you guys. You're lucky. There was a lot of talk about this at Theta. The idea is, when you're activated in the Ark, there's basically two of you, right? One human, one living skin in the Ark. Hmm. You don't want your copy to survive you. You yourself want to survive on the Ark. If the human you dies before the scan is initiated, or closely after, you yourself would live on in the Ark. Amazing, right? Bit faulty on the logic there, but I see where they're going. Um, my cat is clawing the crap out of something on my green screen, so sorry if that was... I don't loud. Did Catherine put you up to this? Killing yourself? Catherine Chun? No. I don't think you understand. She just did scans and put them into the Ark. I hope I get to meet her soon so I can apologize. She always got into trouble with Strawmire when someone killed themselves. I think she's okay with it. <laughs> Where is everyone? I thought there would be like 40 or 50 people here. I don't know. Uh... I'll let you know if I see anyone. You bought vermouth you haven't tried before for vodka martinis the other day. The botanicals are very potent. I'm not sure how you feel about it yet. Ho ho. Hey. Cats are attacking my feet. Is this what it's supposed to look half a shot of it to two shots of vodka and a half shot of olive juice is still overpowering. Yeah, vermouth. When I when I bartend vermouth, I literally just put maybe a quarter shot into the shaker, shake it on its own and then pour out what's left just as waste. And whatever sticks to the ice cubes is the amount of vermouth that you want in your drink. Otherwise, it everyone? just tastes like you're drinking pine. I'm not the only one who got scanned. Robin, I'm not sure how to say this. What? Did Catherine kill herself? This, this is... Yeah? Pretty amazing, right? No, oh, jeez. I mean, the arc. Yeah, it's great. Catherine and the guys really pulled through. They saved us all. Um, I'm a chicken. See you later. Will do. I'll be going now. Let me know if you find anyone else. Come on, tell her, you pussy. I think so. I feel fine. Tell her. Okay, we can't tell her. Um, we could, we could disconnect her. Um. Mark. I don't want to disconnect her. I'm not going to kill her just for fun. Uh, say that part about vermouth again because Maggie started talking to me and I couldn't hear. Um, so what you do is you pour like a half shot of vermouth into the shaker with the ice. 
you shake it, and then you waste the vermouth that's in the glass. Anything that's not sticking to the ice cubes, pour it out. Um, then you make, make the rest of the drink as is. And that's how much vermouth you want in the drink. Because whatever sticks to the ice cube is great, otherwise it just tastes like pine. Okay, what do you guys think? Do I do I pull the plug on this poor robot here who is not where she wanted to be? Because otherwise I feel like she's going to be alive for a long, long time, and I don't know what's kinder. Maybe it's something I'll get better at. Like she sounds so lonely. It's so sad. Uh I can't tell if this is it. Like, I kind of want to pull the plug because I feel bad for her, but I don't know. Is being alive and stuck at the bottom of the ocean better than being dead? It's too philosophical. Uh, Super Justin says pull it. All right. I I think it's probably better to kill her than it is to let her sit here. I feel bad. Well, that was horrific. Um I, I feel bad now. Um, I mean, it was better than leaving her here by herself. Like, she had nobody to talk to. She was going to be here forever. Just surviving. Forever. That sounds like hell. You monster. Shut up, you. <laughs> There we go. This is super complicated to do with the mouse. There we go. I feel so bad that I killed her. Ugh. Judge, jury, and executioner. <laughs> Just call me Dread. Okay. Can I... Ah. Hello? Anyone there? Hmm. Oh, Catherine, we found Theta. Bunch of blood... I'm guessing Acres probably had something to do with this. Hmm. I need a higher level. What's up here? I know this game. We're just gonna go like this and HA! And again, ha ha! Beautiful. Kronos, come here! Oh, 
Okay, so somebody was seeking medical care. Nothing good in the lockers. Ah. We're here? We're here! Okay, great. Time to hijack ourselves a submarine. There will be nothing stopping us when we have the done that. You guys sure have a lot of machines and vehicles down here. What makes this one so special? It's the only transport that can go into the abyss without cracking like a can of soup. If this is one of a kind, then how did they get the Ark down the abyss in the first place? That's a good question. I suppose they did it the hard way and just walked. Hmm. Didn't realize that was an option. Kath, what's it like inside the Ark? Is it like a movie or a virtual reality? No, of course not. It's, you know, like real life, but slightly better. Pleasant temperature, clean air, good weather. Hmm. So people in the Ark just walk around pretending it's the real world? You don't have to pretend. It's perfectly immersive. And it can just sustain itself? Yes. Attached to a pro, fueled by solar panels, it can survive for thousands of years. That sounds Amazing. delightful. Just thinking about the Earth being what it is and us setting out to save the final remains of humanity, it's... It's... Heroic. Uh, at least it feels worth doing. <laughs> Here we go. The Dunbat. Oh, damn it. I knew it was too good to be true. What's wrong? It's... It, it's quarantined. Hold on. We need a security cipher. How bad is it? It's we don't write these things down type of bad. Maybe hmm. someone's still around who can tell us what it is. Hmm. Sure. Well, I just Before killed the lady that, out front. I I'll hope that wasn't her. Doors for you, so you can explore the station. Good, good. Uh, a lot of people are just kind of uh, lurking at, as it's as it says Super Justin, <laughs> which is fine. I mean, it's definitely a good game for that. Okay, site status. Everything seems fine. It's now 2104, it was when all of this was happening. Uh, the main level... Looks like we have the bay over here, and then we have stairs going that away. Level 1 has some black box beacons in it, whatever the hell those are. Level 2... Looks like all your friends moved downstairs. Why abandon the gate? Huh. And the habitat? That's so strange. I don't like this at all. Interesting. Uh, okay. So we have Alvaro, Emma, who is still alive apparently. Robin is just deceased. I'm... I... I killed Robin. I'm sorry. Um, Chun, the engineer, is missing. Deceased, deceased. Joaquin Dufresne, he's still alive. Sean Evans is still alive. Keith for Karen is still alive. Okay, most of these people are dead. And then we have guests who are also dead. Hi. How are you? Was Acres Acres isn't on the list, which makes me a little worried. Couldn't have just moved that girl to near others, had to kill her. Well, she was attached. She was attached to the the green stuff, the, the wow, I think they're calling it. Um, or the, the glowy stuff. So I couldn't actually detach her. She was stuck there. And I, I, I just feel like being alone for eternity would be worse than dying. Like, alone, stuck in one spot, literally unable to do anything, can't see, can't talk to anybody. That sounds hell. Like, real bad. Okay, that's one way I can go. I can also go in, in here. This place looks corrupted. Plus, as a robot, can't you connect to others via the internet? Thanks, uh, That's a helpful report. Be quiet, the proxy listens. What happened to Theta? No explanations anywhere. Kind of sounds like a warning. Hmm. Um... As far as I can tell, all of their internal communication systems are down, so she could literally talk to nobody. 
Kronos, you are blocking all of the screens with your massive, massive body. I know you love it. It's okay. Hmm. Why would they all leave this floor? I don't get it either. It's like they all just cleared out. Interesting. Hi, Kronos. How are you? Yeah. Uh, can't do anything here. Nothing here. Nothing there. Okay. What's in here? The fuck? Error. Good, good, good. Something got mad at me. Huh. I'm curious. Ooh. I'm definitely a robot. I'm a robot in a dive suit. Well, that's fun. Can I... No. Housekeeping... I'm hearing flies. What's so interesting downstairs? Just labs and offices. Maybe the shuttle station. Should we go check? Rather not. Got a bad feeling about this. Okay, nothing dead in here. This is fine. Stop that. Okay, so nothing in the bathrooms, except that you can look at yourself if you want, which is fascinating. Um, those are the stairs. Okay, they locked this one in. Little concerned. Lights are nice, though. Um... Nothing in here. Just a bunch of tools. Nothing in there. And the Mazer Tool Safety. Interesting. Wait, don't don't look into the emitter. Well, that's good. Damn chair, get the hell out of the way. What the hell are you? Oh, you're just a random book. Okay, never mind. I may be stronger than I look. Maybe they wanted to keep close to the shuttle station in case something went wrong. You're really stuck on that one. I'm just worried about my colleagues. Ah, oh, Catherine. Hey, it's the Catherine. AI's room. You want me to bring something? A souvenir? No, it's just memories. Okay. Random fan. Cool fan. Thanks. Reminds me of Taipei, my hometown. I seriously doubt you'll find anything useful in there. Well, I'm going to look anyway. Journal. Uh, Image and Reed tested a machine today. It was clearly corrupted by WoW, but more importantly, it was assembled in a seemingly primitive way. Like someone has... 
You can play with your underwear. <laughs> nice. Uh, like someone has specifically created it for the WoW to steal. When activated, the machine mimic the room uh, and read along with it. At some point, she was scanned and then loaded as a simulation inside the digital space. The presentation shocked Reed and was quickly terminated. It scares me how much you remind me of the AR capsule. Play with her underwear. Right. <laughs> Different sentence there. Uh, after dissecting the vivarium machine that Reed activated, it's clear the WoW copied my capsule project to construct the scene and hold the Reed simulation. It's actually very similar in its construction, except for one point. Where my capsule houses flat people constructed from model neurographs, the vivarium's brain scan lives on. Interesting. It isn't limited by its content from the originating brain scan emerged. So you can carry on, you're not just a scan of what was. Interesting. Uh, I have it, I can save humanity. I can build an artificial reality capsule that can hold every living member of Pathos 2. I can't figure out how it worked in the vivarium, but I can replicate WoW's scanning technique using the pilot seats. They're already prepared with the type of electromagnetic drums needed. Uh, it was even easier than I thought. The pilot seats are already set to allow the diffraction and high energy needed to capture the scan. I suspect WoW has been using the seat to steal scans from us for a while. I guess that explains the Mockingbirds. No idea what the Mockingbirds are. The WoW must have stolen scans from people using the pilot seat and used it as a basis of intelligence for the machines. With a surprisingly positive reaction from the team, we have now officially started the ARC project. We are to scan all the people we can find and load them into the capsule. Then we will launch it into space using the space gun. Space gun. Uh, it's nice to think something will live on. Mark Serang killed himself after his scan. He has been suggesting everyone should kill themselves as it should allow them to actually get on the Ark. I'm not sure how that would work. It did trigger a lot of arguments among the staff, and apparently it's my fault somehow. Strohmeyer is not happy with me. Hope it will calm down. Richard gave me a set of AI templates I haven't seen before, unfolded one of them to make a new friend for Capsule Catherine and her gang of legacies. New way to, simu to simulate turbulences makes the weather system so much better. Implemented Reed didn't go well. Try New try with Reed. Reed won't play nicely with the others. She is too real. Interesting. Let's move that chair out of the way. Scissors. Plastic scissors. You have a lot of toys. <laughs> uh, that's not a sentence you want to say while digging through somebody's nightstand. <laughs> junk looks like something you'd fish out of the ocean huh oh you mean yeah that's a part of reed's vivarium it's it, it, it's a long story forget it okay and there's the ark she really does have a lot of toys your teddy bear could use some repairs toby always breaks he's top heavy so he keeps falling over Why am I enjoying going through this lady's room? Like, this is just weird. The hell? She just has a lump of whatever the hell that is sitting around. That's interesting. Um, hmm, I found a sock. Toby has a sock. Okay, we can get out of here. And this is the guy who killed himself.
heard a noise. Uh, dear friends, when you read this, I will have entered the Ark. As, as, as I've explained, this is accomplished by ceasing to live as your scan is being completed. Do not frighten Catherine. I will do this in secret by folding cyanide salts into chewing gum and placing it in my mouth before seeing her. When I hear her announce completion, I will bite down, quickly causing my own demise. Don't kill yourself with cyanide, by the way. Horrible way to die. Uh, when you discover the truth behind my death, there, know there's no tragedy to mourn, for I am victorious. I advise you all to do the same and join me inside the Ark. Sincerely, Mark Sarang. Well, he's creepy. Did you know that the human body consists of up to 75 trillion individual cells? They typically don't stay with us till we die. Some live a few days, while others live a few years. We're not affected by their short lifespans, as they're replaced by new cells which help sustain our bodies. I don't think anyone would argue that we ever lose our persona due to this process. Yet we are clearly in a constant state of transformation. <laughs> then how do we remain the same? A continuous flow of thought and perception keeps an unbroken chain of continuity that we know as our self. Our conscious mind is not the pattern of our brain, but a continuous emergent entity based on that pattern. When Dr. Chun populates the Ark, she is capturing a moment of our existence and placing it inside the digital world. Soon you and your digital you will grow apart due to diverging experiences, but for a tiny window, you are the very same. With unbroken continuity, it will live on. A fulfilling life, no doubt, no less real than the one from which it was plucked. Now remember, you are not your body. You are the emergent entity. That entity just happens to occupy two places at once for a while. If you took away your body, you would simply be the only one you can be. The you inside the Ark. Let your body die and continue on in the digital paradise among the stars. Okay, so what he's describing is the transporter paradox, um, which is the, the classic paradox from Star Trek where if you transport somewhere using a teleporter, your body is disintegrated and a new one is built for you on the location that you wanted to go. Um, and if one of you don't die, if you don't disintegrate before you're transported and reconstructed, then which one of you is you? Is kind of what he's going for. Um, and he solved that problem by literally killing himself and making sure there was only ever one of him. Which is, I mean, definitely one way to solve that. Nothing overly interesting in the dead man's place. It's the same book I had in my, my apartment. What's this? Classified. The company is very pleased to hear about your success in making the WoW station-wide uh, station presence. We trust you appreciate that this unique opportunity this is and that you will do everything in your power to fully explore and understand this mystery. To do so, you will need to ensure that Dr. Johan Ross is able to steer, the study, steer and study the WoW from Alpha without outside interference. In case, of, in case of emergency, you may direct Yulia Dahl at Omicron to forcefully eliminate any opposition, but please make an effort to avoid extreme actions. The WoW is an important, costly affair, and we hope to follow steady development without setbacks. Interesting. Like the Magician movie. Exactly, yeah. Um, what is that? The Prestige? I think. Very much the same. Yeah, it's the prestige. The illusionist is the uh, same year that it came out, but completely different plot. <laughs> okay, so uh, Dead Man is creepy. I'm going to throw his brain. Be 
because I'm a dick. Um, okay. Oh, Robin. I feel really bad. Seriously. Oh, she liked flowers, too. Was Robin a kid? Did I kill a kid? We're all dying anyway. I'm all in. I put my faith in Sarang and the continuity. Okay, so... Physical Robin killed herself in here. And... She was either a child... Or... Very young. I feel so much worse now. Um... Uh... <laughs> yeah, I, I feel bad. Literally a monster. I mean, you're not wrong. I am an electric suit walking around with somebody else's memories, so I mean... Pretty fucking bad. Oh, that's a grisly way to do it. Jesus. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I killed a child construct, and now I feel real bad. We're just gonna we're gonna move on. This place is corrupted. Can't turn on the lights. But what we can do is fist this thing. I wonder if I'm becoming more and more infected. I know it looks bad, but it makes me feel a lot better. It helps me focus. That's... I, I mean, that's the wow you're hooking up to. I need it, okay? I wouldn't have made it this far without it. <sighs> Let's just keep going. Okay, so yeah, I am being corrupted by the wow every time I do that. That's... that's good to know. I'll just... I'll be leaving. Huh? But Okay, there's something on the other side of the wall. We're going to leave now. I wish it would stop doing that. Something's moving. Okay, no going up. Can't really go down either. Okay, so we are leaving this area. Going over here. Ah, the lab. Got research over here. What's this? This is where I did my scan. And all the others, I suppose. You don't remember? My scan was the first. Had to test the scanner before I could start making promises. Fair. Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab. The scan room. What happened? Conrad killed himself after the scan. Jesus, how? Um, laser tool? What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Strohmeyer. No, please! I'm so close. <laughs> Strohmeyer's gonna shut down the ARC project. It's not my fault people keep killing themselves. Catherine, what are you gonna do? It's not like you can sneak a 300-pound body out of the lab. I know. Catherine, are you okay? 
Not even close. I feel really bad for Catherine, by the way. Like, all she's trying to do is save people from a doomed planet, and they just keep offing themselves in front of her. Like, that's not cool. Also, I love that Sid Swizzles is singing this on the uh, Sea Lab theme. <laughs> ah, Sea. What? Check the terminal. I just want to make sure. Okay. Interesting. And then Berg. Okay. Wait, Jared. What is this? Why do you have a file of me? You are one of Dr. Munchie's templates. The legacy scan. Uh. Interesting. Capture 2015 audio recordings. Okay, that's it. Wow. That was fun. That's a relief. Still figuring this out, so. It was freaky. So many lights. What do we do now? Paul and I are going to run tests for a week or so, and then we'll work out a roadmap to your recovery. Well, I feel excited. Can't wait to get back to the living. We've worked everything out. Everything is legal. Vouched for by Dr. Peak and Professor Wei. Oh, that's great news. No big change in medication. You'll be taking an aspirin every morning, but that's about it. Paul worked out a diet with some variations you should try out. You can continue doing physical therapy. Also, there's some extra cardio training every other day. Okay, getting complicated. Don't worry, it's really not. We're gonna keep an eye on you every week, so we'll be able to adjust the plan if needed. Okay. And I lasted until June? The model was sound. It should have worked. It's not your fault, David. I really wish things had turned out differently. Yeah, me too. I was supposed to save you. Hey, you got my brain on file. Maybe you can put it to some use. <laughs> yeah. Who knows? You'd be okay with that? Using it for my research? Sure. It's like a part of me lives on or something. Like a donated organ. You know what sucks about dying? What? The crash. Everything up till now. The Brain damage, you guys, everything. This made my life so much more real. I started thinking about all the things I was going to do. I'd never been more excited to be alive. All that hope. Wasted. Well, that's depressing. Thank you, game. You didn't make me feel bad enough. Good God. Oh, the munchies on here too. Yeah, he captured himself in April. Interesting. Bleak? Yeah, super bleak. What's a legacy scan? They're historic templates for AI construction. Any self respecting engineer wouldn't use legacies anymore, but they're great for learning. They come with every development kit. So, my brain scan turned into a template for artificial intelligence. You should be proud. So much for that mystery. No magic or time travel needed. I was here all along. Waiting for someone to shove a picture of my brain into a suit and hit the power button. Fascinating. So that explains how I'm here. Um, how much you got here? Connection error. Unable to connect to mainframe, please reset router. Ah, I have to go to the sub-level. Fair enough. Right then. What's over here? Welcome to my place. When I started the art project, I pretty much lived in this lab. Cozy. Yeah, still a connection error. Huh. Apparently I need that for something. Oh, inappropriate story. Uh, okay, fair enough. I really need to increase the price for that one. Um, <laughs> so, a funny inappropriate story. Um, 
about a year ago now, uh, when I still had my beard, uh, which was pre-streaming, I had a beard that was a death spike. Uh, it was about nine inches long, just came out from my chin. Um, I was fooling around with uh, a girl I was semi-seeing at the time, and, you know, kind of rounding the bases as it were, and got to the point where I was going down on her and she all of a sudden flinch and need me in the face real hard and i was just very much thrown back and stunned and i was just like uh why why did that happen and she was so embarrassed and she just sits there and goes oh my god i am so sorry your beard tickled my butthole <laughs> so there you go funny inappropriate story for you super justin Are they similar to my legacy file? No, yours is flatter, if that makes sense. Less dynamic. Thanks. That makes me feel much better. Okay, so this is where all the brain scans are stored. Amazing. <laughs> I'm glad you guys approve. Oh, these are all burnt out. That can't be good. There's one. An intact memory chip. If we're lucky, we might be able to extract the cipher from it. Hydrate. Ah, good stuff. Hydration counts if it's booze, right? <laughs> okay, probably nothing left in here. I think we're good. So I still need to go down and reconnect the router because I can't do anything with this right now. So, to the basement. Double so, perfect. And this creepy ass place. This is really giving me Event Horizon vibes. Like, just super is. It's a completely normal sound for a place under the ocean, right? Time to leave. Not this way. Maybe it's just a fun party. <laughs> oh, good God. What the hell? Where people rip out their eyes and stuff. You know, cheeky fun. Right. <laughs> okay, this looks like the mainframe. But I can't seem to connect anything to it. Uh, creepy still alive lady in the wall. Uh, doesn't want to talk to me. Still alive. It's terrifying. Oh! Well, well, well. Is there something I can do with you? No. Can I can I jump up on things? No. Hmm. Can't access this or this. Okay then. Nothing in there. We're just gonna go in the room that something was beating on the door. This is fine. This is all fine. Is 
Something's in here and it's not happy. Also, you're alive too. What the hell? Good God. Okay, whatever it is, it's over there. Just going to avoid it. Ah, hold on, I get rid of this damn spammer. There we go. Okay. I hit, I hit a dead end. Possibly a literal one. Oh god, it's found me. It found me. It found me. Time to go. Let's, let's go this way. It's so angry. I have no idea what that is, Sid's Whistles, but it's angry. Ah! The router's resetting. I have a feeling I have to hit something else on the router. Oh, he's right there. Oh, what the hell? Senpai, thank you very much for the follow. Oh god, it's following me. Oh shit. Oh god. Run, run far, run far, run fast. Oh shit. <laughs> oh, it's so angry. Oh god. Uh I'm alive. Oh god. Hydrate, I can do that. I'm going to Pause it while I do, though, because this thing is still after me. <laughs> oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's still here. Um. I feel like it's going that way. So if I just very, very quietly and carefully go around the other side. Oh, this thing is all sorts of terrifying, man. Jesus. Um. Where the hell is it? Oh, it's, it's literally right there. We're gonna... We're gonna, we're gonna run. Don't turn around. Stay where you are. Okay, I'm, I'm partially alive. What else does this thing need me to do? Ah, oh, it timed out. Oh god, it's coming. So I need to stay by because it's going to want me to reset it.
Mainframe's online. Time to go. Run, 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 run. It's following me. Time to get the fuck out of Dodge. Oh, good God. Closed door. Closed door is good. The color vision is so fucked up on this right now. Uh huh. -huh. Well, that was terrifying. Where's one of those things I can jab my fist into? Because I need it. Good job, Simon. This better have worked. I'm not going down there again. Something's in here. Something is definitely in here. Save it last. I think you're lying. <laughs> um, okay. Upstairs. Oh, I am so injured. Are you... Can you heal me? Just gonna jam my fist into you. It's fine. I mean, it killed all the lights, but I feel better. I look better. Well, that was unpleasant. Yeah. You're not wrong. Okay, so we go to the lab. Uh, you should be reconnected? You are. Uh, scans are good. Test environments. Do not use. Interesting. Don't want to kink shame, but maybe just don't be fisting everywhere at all you see. <laughs> I mean, you got a point, man. Okay, I feel like I have to be transferring things around here. Um... Go ahead, plug in that chip you found. Okay. There we go. So, slot one is a chip. Slot two has the chip. Machine good, good. To people. See if there's anyone who could know a security cipher. Oh, uh, that would be not Strasky. Uh... Maybe Strasky? Well, let's, let's try Lindwall. No, it won't work. We need someone from Theta Security Group. Ah, fair enough. Um, well, that might be Strasky then. That one won't work either. Look for security people at Kronstadt or Strohmeyer. Fine, fine. Um, you can't remember who's on the security. No, I don't think so. Stromar recruited people from the evacuated sites. They should also know the cipher, if you can find one of them. Uh, well? Wouldn't be Serang. It's not gonna be Robin, is it? Don't want to dig her corpse up again. Okay, try actually reading the info and then pick one. Lady, you are being upsetting. Um, it doesn't say whether or not there's security, so...
I don't want it to be Robin. Uh, she's she's getting annoyed with me. It wasn't Robin. We're fine. Not gonna dig her corpse up again. Very promising. I'll just load him up and get the simulator going. Okay, whoever the hell that was. There that's who are. it is. What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. Uh, well, let's put him on the beach. Uh, no support module though. So bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. What? How did I get here? Welcome back, Mr. Wan. Doctor Chen, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Everything's fine. Theta needs your help. We need a new security cipher. Doctor Chen, I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here. It's empty. It's still empty. There's something really wrong with this place. It's not real. This isn't real. I have to get out of here. Wait, Simon, you just reset the simulation. Don't abort. I felt bad for the guy. That wasn't so bad. So oh, really okay, fair off. enough. Bastard. What? I felt so bad for him. Mr. Vaughn, I need your help. Dr. Chen, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Listen, I really need Sorry, the delay caught me there. I need the new security cipher. Dr. Chun? I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's yeah, no Super Justin, here. you missed some weird shit, dude. It's, empty. it's too empty. There's something really wrong with this place. It's not real. This isn't real. I have to get out of here! Did we just bring that guy to life? I mean, he's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. Damn it, Cat. Why do you shed so much? All. Took it all away again. I really thought that was gonna work. Maybe we can try again. Okay, so if we need a module, then the modules are loaded over here. So just slot this in here. Okay. Okay. Um, can you just put him in the scan room? Yeah. Ski lodge next time? Well, I'm, I'm going to put him in the scan room. And hopefully he just thinks that he hasn't left, you know? Since it should be like me just waking up. And he'll just think he just got scanned, right? Hopefully. That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. What? Where did it? Alice? Congratulations, Mr. Wan. The scan was successful. Chun? Where's Alice? She left. Mr. Wan, I need you to give me the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is the trick. No, it's okay, I promise. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me, Wow, you hear me? You won't break me! Oh, good, he's paranoid. Do we need to turn it off? Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So, what's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. Okay. Is there a module I can pick somewhere? Geez, there was a lot of suicides. You would love to wake up at the ski lodge? I mean, that's fair. I don't think the ski lodge would actually sort out our problem, though. Clotho, stop it. You keep trying to lay on the keyboard, and you're just going to make my computer freeze. It's not going to help. You are also shitting like mad, cat. Jesus Christ. Ah, it's getting up my nose. Ah, ha, ha. There we go. 
Problem is, he recognized Catherine talking. Right. So can we upload somebody else? Um, I can't transfer those over. Hmm. I mean, I could transfer to Versailles, but it literally says do not use right on it. Um, is there anywhere else I can upload things? We just do nothing? That probably won't help. That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up. Bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Mr. Wan. Chun? What happened to I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. There's no need to worry. No, no, that, that's a lie. You're lying. Don't get upset, Mr. Wan. No, 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 no. Well, why are, you, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, John. I... Yeah, okay. Um, so the scan room is probably right. We just need to figure out where the hell we can get a module. And I have no idea where that would be. No. You don't open. Can't do anything with these other than just erasing the files, which is not something I want to do. Can't plug in the chip anywhere. Still can't do anything with those. A sensory limiter. That's corrupt. Okay, never mind. Uh, ha, 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 ha. Can I do a network transfer? No. I am not sure where I can get something for the module. So I don't see any other active computers at the moment. I don't see anywhere I can actually plug things in here. Not in this area? Okay, so I'm on the right track, I'm just not in the right spot. Unless there's there a module in here. 